What's up, squishy people? Neo Bear Wolf and the Squish. And this cute little guy we call the Squish. He's so squishy. He's so sweet. He's just the sweetest kitty. <gasps> Hi, Carl. Welcome to the stream. We're going to play some more Death Stranding. I'm joined here today by Squish and. There's a Zoltar over there. Zoltar over there kicking it with us, too. What up, Zoltar? He's unsh I'm sh unsure how this is gonna play out with with him and Squish both on my desktop. Can y'all can y'all two get along, or is this gonna be a battle royale? I don't know. We'll see. Let's bring the Zoltar in closer to Squish. So far, so good. Zoltar going in for the sniffs. Squish holding strong. It's doing all right, Squish. Is it stressful that there's a kitty so close to you? Zoltar is just meandering off to go hang out in his kitty tree. Here, I'll spray him some, some kitty nip spray. In his kitty tree. Yeah, this is good so far. We'll see. We'll see how things go. So yeah, we're going to play some more Death Stranding. I don't entirely remember where we left off. Okay. There we go. Port not shitty. We gotta go with the. Uh, uh, let's see. Baby is good. I'm good. I think we took care of about everything before we left. Let's see. I definitely, definitely want to wear my new hat. I haven't put it on yet, so make us look pretty snazzy there, Kyle. Ugh. You have a long journey. Yeah, I feel like I gotta make it to the freaking west coast and. Wherever the hell else this game might take me. Ooh, let's see what our baby. Let's see what old boy's up to. Take a look. This is what the world looked like hundreds of millions of years ago. There's just one big continent. Pangea. And Gaia, however people want to say it. Do you know what this is? The moon. Good day, Medros. How are you? I'll show you the real thing soon. I promise. I'm still super curious to find out what role this dude plays in all this. We'll get there, man. We'll get there. Don't worry. The whole wide world will be yours to explore. You'll be able to go wherever you want. Even the moon. I'm really curious if sent God, it's so loud. Of course, all my speaker settings are on the other freaking monitor. I gotta turn it down for myself. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. Can you guys hear it okay, though? Um. Okay, there we go. I just dropped it 60. Let me know if that uh, makes it too quiet for you guys. But man, I had to turn it down. Like, um, I had my headphones plugged into the back speaker, but my cord going into my headphones went bad, so I had to change it to the front speaker. And the front speaker is like crazy freaking loud in my ears. How you doing, Sam? Anybody home? <laughs> okay, what are we doing? Um, gear check. Let's see what all we got. Ladder. Grenades. Two grenades. Ooh, bad boots. Alright, we need a spare pair of boots. And maybe some grenades. Grenades. You can hear fine art. Sam, I received word from Mama that she's completed her anti BT weapon. Her anti squish T weapon. Prototypes of her design form a part of her next shipment. A delivery of relief supplies for the people of Port Knot City. Port Knot City is a fair distance from BT territory, but the weapons should come in handy if any stray too close. 
They'll also provide people with the means to defend themselves when traveling outside the city limits. The shipment also includes a variety of medicines, as well as human sperm and egg samples. These specimens are essential for maintaining genetic diversity as they were donated by civilians living outside the major population Yay, centers. now I'm delivering sperm. By taking advantage of Chirelium's temporal properties, we can ensure they remain viable yes, for as long for as required. Yes, thank you for scratching for the squish. Connect the Cupid. Now, once that's done, the entire region will be integrated into the Chiral network. Afterwards, you'll be pushing on to Lake Knot City. So, we've included relief supplies for the people there as well. Of course, to get there, you'll need to cross over the lake in between. Details on that will be in a second order you'll need to accept then. Without a doubt, this will be your longest run for us to date. Make sure you've got everything you need. Well, I was in the process of making sure I had everything I need, but you decided to freaking uh, yap at me. Freaking dick. What do I got in my private locker? Nothing. Okay. Well, that's not particularly helpful. Guess we're just going to fabricate, Squish. We are going to fabricate. PCC? Boots. One pair of boots. I thought they said they had some grenades or some shit for me. Tools. What's with the tools? Where are they going? Deliver. Uh, I don't see myself making it back there anytime soon. Ah, oh, shit. We should have taken a shower. You know what? Two grenades. I think that's okay. Let's go. Let's do this. Dude, T-Mart, this is one of the most gorgeous games I've ever played. And it's just as silky freaking smooth as Metal Gear Solid 5. Like, this game... I, I love it. It's so good. We're reconnecting America, man. If you don't like America, you can get out. <laughs> Alright, we're at freaking Capital City, and we gotta go all the way to freaking Port City. Pretty googly mooglies. There's a lot of cool social aspects to this game as well. Like, the more... If you remember when we started this game, this, this path was just grass. And part of the social social function of this game, the more people that travel a certain path, it actually creates a trail. Like, I didn't put these bridges there. Some other players did. So it's pretty cool. My motorbike of destruction. I mean, it's entertaining me. It's entertaining uh, me a lot more than... A lot of games this <laughs> this year. I wonder what other ways ways have people been going. Let's see, I guess I I guess maybe there is a path through the incinerator. Like I probably could. I wonder if I could have taken my bike that route though. Possibly. See this 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 part right here doesn't look particularly bike friendly. When does the arc update come out? December? I'm not sure what day. This Friday we're gonna play the new Star Wars. Actually, 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 we might be playing the new Star Wars Thursday if they have a nine o'clock release for it. We'll do another late stream Thursday. That'd be pretty cool. We're not going to worry about any packages. We're going to uh, just head to the lake. Lost Lake. Shell City. You sold my crown to Shell City. I'm just happy we have a bike for most of this journey. Because otherwise, it'd be kind of a long run. Oh, damn it like the 90th time I've done. Okay, maybe like the second. <laughs> boom, 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 
upon the wheeling in the rain. I like how if we sat in this rain long enough, we can actually watch our motorcycle collect rust. It's pretty wild. We hope you are well rested. I am very well rested. Oh, uh, that's a mule camp. That is definitely not what I'm after. Yeah, if you just sit out in the rain, you can actually watch your stuff rust to include your bike. It's pretty wild. Did I just say that? I don't remember. Can I run these guys over? That's that's the real... That's the real conundrum. Oh! You can't when I run into a friggin' boulder. Well, this guy doesn't hear a bike up behind him. Who are you? Come on! Yeah! All right, all right, we'll go. <laughs> what up, solitaire? What's up, man? Welcome to the stream. Have you had a chance to dig into this? A lot of people are giving this game flack, but I am thoroughly enjoying it. Thoroughly. Generally. No. Not, not getting into this. Probably one of the more fun games I've played this year. Distribution Center. Stretch my legs. I'm pretty sure that's where I'm headed. So. Oh yeah, we're going to the Distro Center. So, kind of no reason for us not to pick this up. That's the kind of thing. I mean, that's understandable. Like a lot of people say, you know, you, it's one of those games that's either going to be your thing or not. It was pretty damn fascinating to me. Looks amazing, plays amazing, sounds amazing. And I actually don't mind being a post-apocalyptic delivery guy. I'm just waiting for the moment when I can deliver somebody a pizza because that's important. <laughs> Lots of cool social functions I've never really seen done in a game before, so that's awesome too. This game has kind of a lot going for it. I'm not right now. I actually stream through my regular PlayStation. My PS Pro's in the other room. So yeah, I played it on both, but I'm not on my Pro right now. Important and profitable, indeed. Probably one of the biggest bonuses, one of the biggest yays I see about this game is I have not experienced any, any pop-in yet in this game. None whatsoever. I cannot say the same thing about any other game I've played this year. Borderlands 3 had pop-in. Uh, whatever game we played before this had lots of freaking pop-in. This game, haven't haven't seen any. Look at that right, McScowns. Deliver some junk here. Just the attention to detail in this game is really what blows me away. Yeah, I'm back. I know I'm a damn good delivery guy. Yes, rank. Oh, oh, I was hoping. Wait. Oh, we did get the fourth star. Nice. 35, we're a skilled handler. Oh, <laughs> y'all heard it. Skilled handler. <laughs> Bye, haven't had... New order haven't had this game crash on me. At all. Okay. I think we've delivered everything we can. Let's go. We didn't need a rest or anything. We were just delivering that on the way. Uh, no. Just get on the bike. I don't. <laughs> the speed of the bike is also impacted by your weight too, so um, keep that in mind. Okay, we gotta get. We gotta get past there. Oh yeah, like I was saying earlier, 
the more people that are playing this game that take a certain path, it'll start to wear the grass down. It'll actually make a dirt trail. So that's pretty freaking sweet. Like right here, a few people have taken this road, so it's starting to wear the grass their way. I think maybe... Actually, I think I need to be at that ridge up there. Alright, we should be able to get across. Come on, you can do it! It's an electric bike, so dipping it in water, you know, kind of drains the battery pretty quick. I mean, it's a gorgeous freaking landscape. Like I said, it runs silky freaking smooth, man. Like, zero issues. Wait, we're in... We're in BT land? Oh shit, we are. Okay, so we might as well get off the bike. Get off the bike and make damn sure we're actually... in the right way here. Oh, I don't actually have it marked. Uh... Okay, so we are going the right way. Wait, Cavern, not city. Wait, did I not pick up my freaking supplies? That didn't make sense. Oh no, I don't even have the supplies. What? Hmm, I wonder if there's a quick way back. I'm sure it's auto saved since. How the hell did I leave without even taking the supplies? We talked. To, we talked to the dude. Let's see. What a previously saved game. Let's see. What time is it now? Three forty-seven. Thirty-five. Okay, this one. This one should probably be pretty close. Ugh, it's true. All that travel for a fail. I don't know what happened to the cargo. Like, I talked to the guy, he gave me the mission. I thought I had accepted the mission, but apparently I didn't. That's right, Squish. Apparently we breaking didn't. You know what, I think, I think it might be a good opportunity for some Zoltar cam. QM0, this fail sound. Actually, I have one, let's see. Where is it? I thought I had one. I should. Let's see how long this lasts. That one. That loose sound. It's a Zoltar. It's just the beast. It's just the beast cleaning himself. Oh yeah, resume game. Scanning bridges ID. Okay. ID. Good, we're in Capital Not City. Sam, I received don't give the shizzles. Ooh, don't give a shizzles. Berber. Ooh, I love Stone Chipper. Oh, look at Madros. Oh my god. Freaking 99. That's a transfusion bag. What? Okay, that's nice. Let's see, a minute, oh, please stop Sam, calling me. Yes, I, I, I understand. You know, but you still yes, blood grenades, got it. Let's make another one. In a blood bag, yes. Do I need anything else? Container repair spray, you know what, let's make one of these, just in case. And I think we need the spare boots, all right. And then we're gonna take this journey off. Ugh. Sperm and eggs. That's Hawaii's favorite. Sperm and eggs. I mean, spam and eggs. <laughs> Although, you never know. That's Brazzer's favorite breakfast. Sperm and eggs. <laughs> Sounds like, oh, goddamn. 
<laughs> Order assigned. Uh, uh. Um. Uh, yeah, we're still headed there anyway. So, oh well, let's do this again. <laughs> Look, honestly, people in Hawaii love spamming eggs. It's like their thing for some reason. Like they even sell it at fast food places. You can go to Hardy's, McDonald's, wherever and get spamming eggs. Um. Sam, looks like you've got some more orders to take care of. Remember, once you get to Port Knot City, you'll be crossing the lake. So you should make any pending deliveries before then. The only Take pending delivery I'm making is delivering my ass to Port Knot City. You need to go. I don't even need a bridge there. It's just a creek. Well, now that the roads are destroyed and shit, they have to rely on like manually carrying this stuff. Which is kind of why, you know, we're a post-apocalyptic delivery boy. Oh yeah, BT territory. Come on, bike, start it! At least rest your head out here, Zoltar. If he's got his head all the way in, you guys can't even freaking see him. He's got that kitty camo. All right, we gotta dodge just some BTs. Oh! It is not fun when the BTs spot you. Trust me. Shit goes absolutely cray cray. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Ugh. Okay, just keep rolling. Let's get you rolling. All right, we're good. I like how the bridges light up too. Ah, oh, I'm not falling for this shit again. <laughs> it learns, it adapts. I mean, whether or not they were rationing spam during World War II or not, it, it's like a local delicacy. Like, it really didn't have much to do with the Americans. Like, the Hawaiians are the ones that predominantly order it. I don't know why it's uh, such a big deal to them. Just, it's one of those, one of those things, man. If I had to associate any particular food to be in Hawaiian, it would definitely be Spam and Eggs. Because I can't think of anything else that is specifically Hawaiian cuisine. It's just kind of a... Hawaiian food is kind of like a mix of every damn thing. It's like they don't... They can't decide what they want to make, so they just slap a whole bunch of stuff together. Like, good luck finding good Mexican food in Hawaii. Post-war meat had to get in there somehow. <laughs> I'm sure the GIs brought a lot of meat with them. But I'm okay. I think I heard somebody say that before, and it was more like a Japanese cuisine that they actually just kind of brought over to Hawaii. Like I said, Hawaiian food is just. It's lost, really. If if there was Hawaiian food, it's lost. Oh, what more? It's, it's too blended with Japanese food and American food and freaking everything else. Wait, were there BTs here last time we rolled through? I don't remember. 
All right, well, we're just gonna... No, screw these guys. Hell with these hippies. They can do whatever the hell they want, but I am outie. It's also pretty funny, Hawaiians kind of don't like to know what they are. They want to be Pacific Islanders, some of them want to be Polynesian, some of them want to be Americans. It's like you're a state. You're a state. You're American. You may not be part of the continental U.S., but you're a state. Face it! I feel like we've had this conversation before. Oh, rapid banana leaves. I don't know. I never had any good barbecue in Hawaii. All right, let's lose 15 pounds worth of stuff here. Damn right, it's in damn fine shape. Cause I'm the bomb deliverer, baby. Give me, the, give me my S for awesome. Zoltar, where are you going? You can't leave the confines, Zoltar. You know what, I'm gonna go ahead and take this bridge this time. Damn people like calling me on my freaking phone. Let's let's do this. There he is. Eh! There we go, there's a there's a there's a proper kitty cam. Who that call on my Sam, phone? It's Hartman. Of course it is. Your friend and fellow Doom sufferer. <laughs> Still not entirely um, sure what Dooms is as an affliction. Our discovery of it. Once the question of life after death was answered only by religion and philosophy. But when we learned of the beach's existence, death became something more tangible, knowable. The living soon walked the shores of the afterlife, while dead things beached things and began to find their way back. And then came doom. This is funny, you can actually and run over cargo and ruin it. Advanced by physicians and For whatever reason that is. Desperate to explain the or, I mean, whatever purpose that pump serves. The symptoms were duly categorized and stratified into levels. But repatriates like you are a singularly rare breed, worthy of a classification all your own. The specialists must have been climbing over one another to get a look at you. <laughs> I wonder what they found. Alright, we're pretty much back where we were. Come on, you can take this bike a little further. Don't be scared. Alright, I reckon this is where we part ways. Well, I don't think anything's irradiated. Not yet, anyways. Like, the rain's not radioactive. The rain has time properties. They, they call it time fall instead of rainfall. Because anything it, it touches as it's raining... Uh, steals time like if it hits your skin it'll age your skin and then it then it just turns to water all right there's one over there I'm not sure the best course to take here no oh, what are you what are you doing controller quit wigging out on me Uh, I'm not sure what's the best route. Top side. Or maybe the rocks. I kind of feel like both ways are going to have BTs. Alright, let's crouch it just a little bit. 
Alright, we're good. For the moment. Maybe we can get around the entire BT area. Eh, of course, maybe not. Alright, let's take a peek here. Uh, we're on the right course. We can... You know what? I gotta wanna take the high path. Why not? Closing in on one of them. There he is. There it is. Nice and easy does it. Yeah. Put that guy behind me. Thing is, they're freaking everywhere, so I'm not. I don't think either path would have been better than the other. Oh, oh, Sammy, Sammy, slow it down, dude. Ouch. Oh, shit. Add a grenade. You know what? These guys. Fork this thing. Get out of my damn way. Well, that's only horribly creepy as hell. Yeah, I was stationed in Hawaii for four years and I freaking loved it. Except for, you know, you couldn't get good Mexican food. <laughs> Other than that, it was pretty nice. Lost cargo. Yeah, I'm not going to the wind farm. Yeah, it's funny. All this lost cargo is stuff that other players dropped along the way. Because they suck, Stormy. They ain't got the skills to pay them bills. Maybe we're kind of taking the hard road here. Of course, I don't know why they were carrying wind farm equipment this way. Oh, Kyle! Kyle with a zero. Actually, the best, probably the best food I had in Hawaii was the pancakes. Like, they had a number of pancake houses that were just freaking amazing. Okay, I'm guessing my destination is through here. I still got grenades. I mean, I don't have any reason not to obliterate these things. You know, if it gets them out of my way. Disintegrate the dead. Oh, that one's still there? Oh, we turned him red, though. That's weird. Get out of here. Shoot. What up, Kasim? How you doing, man? Kasim, we're uh, discussing food in Hawaii. Tell us about, tell us about Pakistani food. Like, what does Pakistan have for good eats? Man, we're still trudging through freaking BT territory. What in the world? I, I could just take it out. I could just kind of go around it. I want to use all of my grenades. Doing pretty good, man. Doing pretty good. Who here is spicy? Well, you're already talking my language. So... Man, I love me some spicy food, dude. Mainly because there ain't nobody in this freaking state that knows how to make spicy food. 
Row, row. Hey, what is that? Oh, don't, don't fall into a BT. Oh shit. Memory chips. Sam, if you stumble across any memory chips on the road, be sure to submit them via the nearest terminal. There's no telling what kind of rare and valuable data they might contain. Huh, that's you a... to make someone very, very happy with your contribution. That's the first time I found a memory chip. Huh. Oh, I love spicy food so much. Barely solitary. <laughs> it's funny, the only place that really seems to season their food here is the Mexican food and... Bojangles. That that's like it, man. I love it when Bojangles overseasons their fries. It's just like the it's the best thing ever. Let's just consist of rice. Oh my god, look at that! Look at that! It is fucking gorgeous. Even look at even Zoltar's looking at it like wow, damn. Stop scratching. Stop scratching. Just take it in, man. Look at that. Look at this landscape. That that's this top notch, man. That is the only thing comparable. I think would be God of the new God of War in Horizon Zero Dawn. Like this is just oh. Uh, Norman, no. It's Cliff, bro. Whoa, dude. Slow, slow. Controlled fall, Norman. Controlled fall. I, I've heard they're doing a sequel to Horizon Zero Dawn, but I haven't seen anything about it. I mean, I don't, I don't see why not. It's... It's a giant universe, you could do anything you wanted, you know? Oh my god, the story of Horizon Zero Dawn was so depressing. It was so sad. Especially once you actually found out what Project Zero Dawn was, then you're like, oh. Oh, that's... Uh, biryani? I will try to remember that. But again, I live in the South, so, you know, getting any kind of Middle Eastern food is unlikely. Uh, it's just so good, because we can explore all of this. Da, 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 da. Oh, so freaking pretty. There's my boat in the distance, too. I want to. I want to try all kinds of new food, but there's just kind of not much around this area to really even think about doing that. Pretty, pretty nice tune too. It's definitely adventure music. All right, since Zoltar is laying down, <gasps> maybe we can do some squishy. I got a Zoltar and a Squish in here. Oh, it really is stormy. It's so peaceful when it, the music kicks in. It's just like, no matter what's going on in the game, it just instantly puts you at ease. 
the soundtrack in this game is just so chill. Man, so the road to this place just got straight up completely washed out, huh? I just, I love how relatable and human they made the character in this game. Like, I realize he is human, but just all the attention to detail and the mannerisms and stuff, it's just so good. Yeah, the only reason I switched to Ant Angle is so I can see my little BT detector. Spooky noise. It's like, oh, I need some rest. Decontaminating <sighs> suit. All clear. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. I was playing this in the other room, and I was running down that ramp, took the turn too fast, and just completely busted my ass. <laughs> it wasn't it was funny, but it wasn't pretty. Hey good squish. You the porter, the one man army sent Wait, you're getting out of camera now? Quit scratching. You and your two feet to fill all their boots. Cargo's in perfect condition. No more lie. That's some feet. Get it? I walked here. That's some feet. Ha ha. Squish, lay your ass back down. Quit scratching. Quit it. Next, 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 next. Oh, we got some sound data. Sweet. Asylums for the feeling feet. And we got a song for the feeling feet. <laughs> I walked a good chunk of that. What are you talking about? So you heard a hush? Yeah. Is that cool? Hell yeah. Go for it. Been waiting forever today for this. Maybe somebody else should have got off their ass and started linking the place, huh? It's like nobody did shit before Sam came on. We're making the information super highway all the way across America. Whoa, we got the East Coast. Let's see, interviews. Didn't get any. Didn't get any recipes. Wait. What? Where'd you get that? That little guy. Same as mine. Where the hell did you get it? Oh, he's got the little what astronaut thing. Say? The little guy he came with the pod, if you gotta know. And who'd you get the pod from? Igor, from Corpse Disposal. My little brother. Aww. Igor's dead, bruh. So, what? He just gave one of these to you. Why? I was there with him, at the end. We were moving a body. Things went to shit. There's BTs everywhere. And one of them grabbed him. So he told me to take it and run. Uh, Brian. It's like squish so what's your the camera. story? You lived through a catastrophe like that only to keep on doing the same work. Okay. Been a long time coming, I suppose. You take good care of that little guy. He belongs with the expedition. With you. All right. Better be take this with you too, I reckon. Ooh, what you got Can't for think me? Of anyone who could use it more. Uh -huh. 
What have we here? Oh, grenades and blood bags. Um, sure. I will take all that if you don't mind. Actually, let's select, 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 select. Carry it on the back. Auto arrange the cargo. Yes, please pleasums. And let's giggity. Sam, you've done it. I know I did. Port Knot City is back on the grid. This community, a part of the UCA, their data, a part of our shared wisdom. With enough time and enough cargo printers, they'll be able to build ships. And one day, the waters will be ours again. All because you led the way. Though what follows in your wake isn't always good. Any city that joins the UCA becomes a bigger target for the terrorists. Can't but let them tear his win. Can't let the terrorists no, win, Squish. The rest of America is waiting, Sam. Waiting for you to take the first step and connect them to the chiral network. I know you can reach them. Make us whole again. Make us whole again, Squish. Thanks. One more C in the UCA, huh? So, you fix it across the lake and head west? Yeah. We got a boat? No, not for years now. Terrorists took out everything, bridges, and floats. Only boat in town belongs to a private courier. Private courier? Don't tell me. Fragile Express? That's the one. I already spoke with their rep. I'm having them load the boat with some of the supplies you brought us. I'll bet the folks in Lake Knot will be tickled pink to see someone come into port. Been a while, I expect. Head on down to the harbor when you're ready. It's right outside the distro center. Don't worry, Port Knot never gets the rain. Feel free to rest up in your room before you head out. I think we should take a rest. Actually, it's probably story related that we rest. Slide a squish to the right, slide a squish to the left, slide a squish, slide a squish, slide. Don't, don't move, squish. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. There we go. Would you like a bug, Sam? They transfer blood every time I lay in bed. What's up, Smiley? Blood collection complete. Thank you for your generosity. See, every time I lay down, they they take a bag of my blood. I don't know if uh, seems like it might wear on you in a while. Take a shower, squish. Hey, did not literally just tell to skip. EX grenade number zero. If you, it's funny, if you go a while without showering and then you shower, it'll actually give you more of the X grenades. Okay, let's see. Baby is in good condition. Let's put my put my hat back on. Put the hat back on, squish. So how was everybody's weekend? Anyone do anything particularly exciting? Nothing at all? Aw, oh, baby's fussing. Oh, never mind, he's asleep. Oh. He honestly looks like he hates the hat. I mean, he honestly looks like he hates everything, so. <laughs> Pretty much nothing at all. There we go. There's Leaf Private Room. You got a gaming laptop? Sweet. What kind? Damn, Solitaire. I'm going to uh, do a number on you, huh? Brought you an astronaut. Mankind can go anywhere, even out of space. 
be out of there in no time. And second, all this is over. I'm going to take him wherever you want to go. Freezing and snowing. Uh, I hope we get some snow this year. It would be so nice. Keep on, keep on. Have a pleasant journey. Have a pleasant journey. Oh, wait a minute. Actually, we need to check our private locker because they gave us a bunch of grenades and stuff. Oh, sounds pretty sweet, Kasim. I, I need to get a new laptop someday. Private locker. What do we got? Um, blood bags. Oh, we just got a blood bag. Take that. Why not? All right, we got a couple of grenades. We got X grenades. Attached to suit on tool rack. Utility pouches. Okay, I can't think of really anything we uh, may not need. Let's get to it. Let's get on our boat. Have a pleasant journey. Keep on keeping on. What's the time for me? It is 4.27 in the afternoon. Uh-oh. The inverted rainbow is never a good sign. Of course, neither, neither is the power being out. What up, Gavin? Um, not entirely sure just yet. I'll chat more about it after the cutscene. The name's Higgs. Higgins. The particle of God that permeates all. Existence. Ah, so it was you that dragged him into all this. <laughs> Bloodied but unbound. President dead and burned. Oh, and now the girl's been chosen to take mommy's place. Well, that won't wash. She's not cut out for politics, is she? Oh, but don't worry. I'll find her. And I'll keep her real safe. <laughs> You see, I've come to understand the truth of the Death Stranding. What is this dude's f***ing deal? Oh, there's so much you people don't know. The girl, for instance. She's not like you or me. Dooms ain't her thing. And she's more into destruction on a worldwide scale. An extinction entity. Oh, it's so hard to form connections when you can't shake hands. Fortunately, I've got a good connection to the other side. Now you, you're no bridge. To me, I'm bound to all of it. This world, that world, and our sweet little angel of death. Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> You're on the menu. And all it'll take is one itty bitty void out to blow us all to kingdom come. So how about it? Aren't you getting tired of the grind? Isn't this what you've been waiting for this whole time? A game over. Sam's like, uh, no, not, not really. Oh shit, um, so grenades, I guess. Heads up, Sam. According to our damage assessments, it would only take a single void out to total Port Knot City. Shit, you a think? A single BT allowed to make contact with a civilian would be enough. We can't let that happen. You've got to deal with that BT right now. Oh, what happened? They throw a grenade. Says it's equipped. Used. Okay, um. Squish, please get your claws out of me. Alright, you know what? You get down. He's digging his claws into my arms. Shit hurts. Ah! Okay, so it looks like we gotta have him on the tool rack. So let's offload that. Hang on, tool rack. How many can we put on the tool rack? Hang on, tool rack. Blood bag. Placing utility. Cancel. Okay, now let's see if we can use the freaking grenades again. Oh, shizzles. There we go. Five grenades. Take that, you shit. And more. Oh! Didn't like that. Keep on trucking. Oh, that's not good. That's really creepy. Love that shit. Damn. Oh, more grenades. Yes, please. Boom. I think there's an interval between when you can hit it. There we go. There's another successful hit. Oh, my baby is getting stressed out. Uh, oh, the, oh, it's way over there. I'm trying to find a decent place to fight. I, I don't know what it is with everything like popping out of the water. Like there's buses and cars and buildings. I'm guessing everything that blew up in the void out just got like teleported to the other side. So it's actually the other world merging with our own, kind of, maybe. It'd be nice if I could say I was any felt any safer up here. Bitch. Come here. Oh wait, 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 wait. Zero. I thought they had five charges. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, let's get rid of that shit then. Offload. Offload. The good. The cool thing about offloading and using this stuff, it, you know, it makes us lighter as well. Maybe it's only hanging one on the tool rack per... Maybe it just replaced it. Alright, Bilbo dickbaggins. We can get some. Why aren't you... Why are you not aiming it? 
What is going on? Oh, I had something in my hand. Okay. Yeah, this thing actually drags stuff under the goop with it. Yeah, I see you. Take this one in the face. Oh! Yeah, see? Like, the whole building is gone now. Maybe don't. Maybe don't. These grenades are just so freaking cool, man. Oh, what the hell is that? Oh, they're throwing me supplies! Oh, that's cool as shit. Some, somebody just like popped out of the water and started throwing me supplies. And by cool as shit, I mean weird. Offload that. Hang on, tool rack. Put him down. Oh, I'm gonna get smacked. Holy crap, I didn't get smacked. bizarre. <laughs> it's just straight freaking bizarre. We took down us a B freaking T. <laughs> Holy shit. Normie is just like, I'm so tired. I'm so over this shit. Incredible. Simply incredible. For the first time in history, a human being has defeated a BT. Were you not a repatriate, I doubt it would have been possible. Not only does contact with your fluids pose no risk of triggering a void out, but in much the same way as your car is rejected by the beach, your blood can be used to expel BTs from our world and return them to the other side. You've given us hope, Sam. Dead fish Perhaps everywhere. Perhaps we may yet be saved. Be proud, my friend. Emily's still waiting for you in the west. Head to your boat. It's ready. Get those supplies to Lake Knot City. We're just getting started. Can a brother take a nap and a shower first? I think we take a celebratory whiz. No, can't do it now. What? Why can't you do it now? What's up? Can you? Welcome to the stream. Gavin, you still here? You still need what we know of the story so far? Boat, Sam. Before you do, be aware that you'll have to leave behind any cargo you haven't gotten around to delivering. Why is the boat It'd not big enough? It'd be a shame to abandon something important, though. Especially if you are close to finishing a run. My advice, put that stuff in your private locker in Port Knot City. Screw that. Or, if you're feeling responsible, you could just delay your boat trip until you've tied up loose ends. It's your call. I think we're gonna need a better explanation as to why I can't take the cargo with me. Like you said, is, is the boat too small? Are we taking a fishing boat? Like a rowboat?
snack? Man, this bitch is always offering me bugs. Like, no, I don't want your you bugs. Came through, then. I don't know if you washed your hands. I don't break that easy. Name notwithstanding. You saw that asshole too, right? Higgs, he's the leader of a separatist group. Seemed to me like he was controlling that BT. That's level seven for you. Higher, maybe. Seems like you know a lot about him. Used to work together. Guess you could say we had a contract. You did business with terrorists? Whoever pays, huh? He wasn't like that back then. So what's your angle? You want to save the world, or you want to fuck it all up like him? I wish I... I just wish things were different, all right? Here's all right. Okay, that boat looks like it has plenty of room for any cargo I may be carrying. Don't worry, she still floats. Come on, we're the only cargo left. Episode 3, Fragile. It's French. <laughs> Looks like a terrible umbrella. It could be. Could be a Gucci umbrella. Squish, is it a Gucci umbrella? Squish. Squish says it's a Squish brand umbrella. Go figure. It's because you know you can't design umbrellas, right? Just looking at me like, don't tell me what I can and can't do. You don't know me. You don't know what I do when you sleep. Ah, good, he got a shower. He was looking, uh, pretty messy. Pretty messy. It must be cold outside or else she'd be burning up in them pants. We should get there tomorrow. Offer me another bug. Maybe that'll make it better. It's like the eighth time he's dropped that photo. Kind of getting the feeling he doesn't care to even carry it. I told you before, Sam. The past just won't let go. Cargo over picture. Listen, I have something to ask of you. It has to do with that asshole, Higgs. <laughs> He's PTFO. <sighs> Gotta be tired from all that running around, sneaking, fighting oil whales and shit. I'd be tired too. I deserve a damn nap. from the Matrix. Girl in the red dress, did you see her? Sam. Sam. Do you remember? Do you remember? Get all my squishy coses.
twenty first night of September. Do you remember? <laughs> Kiyu knows what's up. It's almost time to go, Sam. There's still a lot of concepts in this game I still need to fully understand. There's still a lot of I acronyms. No I don't know what they mean. Me. No idea that I was alive. Living is no different from being dead if you're all alone. Or alone. I don't want to go home. I don't want to go home. Home is where the heart is, kid. Now suck it up, Buttercup. Here. It's a dream catcher. Wear it when you sleep, and I'll keep the nightmares away. I'll always be with you. Did you forget how to go home? Come what you doing, Squish? I'll take you halfway. And then you can do the rest by yourself. It's not so bad when he reaches his paws up like that. But it's when he has his claws out. He, he's done it before where he reached up and like got his claws in my I'm nostrils and was like... And I was like... Ah! <laughs> Voodoo. Dreamcatcher was a weird... Don't do it, Squish. We're not we repeating that incident. A lot in this place. You brought me here. I did not like you that I day. I make the trip on my own. So long as you have a body to return to. Oh my God, Kiyu! You can't it was come and go as you please. Go. So you can't just come back east through here. Wait, she's walking into the water with him. Not what the? until you make us whole again, Sam. You want to walk me out into the middle of the lake like you did before? You Jason Voorhees acted. I'll beach. be waiting for you on the beach. On the beach, Squish. <laughs> Come and find me. Interesting. Come and find me, Squish. Poor Fragile. Still not entirely sure what her deal is. Yeah, that's my face, Squish. It is my face. Kitties have tore up my freaking arm. Can't say that I particularly appreciate it. I don't know if you guys can tell, but my arm is like just freaking clawed up and red as hell. That's all Squish marks. Just like kneading my arm with his freaking claws, just shing, shing, shing. Squish wheel, please, certainly. Fitty, fitty squish hairs. Anybody else care for their squish wheel? Patrons, members. You see the cuts in your legs from your kitty or your your dog? I got like part of a kitty claw stuck in my arm. It's kind of like a splinter, but it's a kitty claw. I don't know how you sleep. Need a pick me up? Again with the bugs. She probably doesn't get kissed very much. Welcome often. to Lake Knot City. I'm guessing what? I'm guessing Enough. beef isn't a thing anymore. Let's go. No, oh, there ain't no rest for the wicked. Squishy don't grow on trees. They're quantum bugs, Kiyu. 
Like, they really are. Like, they're they're quantum bugs or some shit. This cargo is from Port Nut City, bound for Lake Knot. Like, they float and all kinds of weird shit. I'll leave these up to you. The dispatch terminal is up ahead. In the meantime, I've got some business to attend to. Later, alligator. She does get that quantum booty. Yeah, latex is a big thing in this game, too, for some reason. I guess jeans disappeared with the voids out. I don't know. All right, what the hell we got here? A bunch of grenades. My sperm and eggs. Can't forget that. Blood bags, grenades, container repair sprays. Look at it. Look at that mad stackage. <laughs> Wait, wrong button. Cargo. Properly. Damn it. Confirm. Tartagrains. Pedigrin Took. There's a time for everything. Ceramics. Lost cargo. No, stop trying to pee. You see, exactly. I said that. The last stream, I was like, there's no way Sam skips, skips freaking leg day, man, because it'd be crazy. Give me a nice tune. Let's check this place out. Courtesy of Tone Quake Records. It says courtesy, but I'm still going to get a copyright claim for it. What up, Will? Good to see you, man. See, we got resins. I'll take this lost cargo because it's going to the city. Oh, straighten out. Come on. Come on, Sam. Sam! Just chill. Just chill. Yeah. There we go. Like the loud. Oh my god, I was so annoyed. The first stream I did with this. Friggin' members only chat. I had no friggin' idea. Yeah, I need to slow down just a bit. Crash, I mean, you can. You can totally bust your ass in this game. It damages the cargo when you do that, and you can drop stuff too. <laughs> Like, eh, eh. I call this the preparing for PCS day. Oh, come on, don't do it. I just need to make it. I just need to make it to the bridges, baby. I have become comfortably numb. He's tucking and running, man. No! Oh, just do it. Slow it down, Norman. I'm even carrying shit on my arms like, Urgh. Compilation of people getting hurt. <laughs> I imagine there are some pretty funny fails in this game. I do try to be careful, but sometimes I slip up. Of cargo for you bastards. If you would just be so kind as to take every bit of this off of me, that would be grand. Yay! Deliver all this freaking lost cargo. You guys excited for some Star Wars on Thursday? Possibly Guys, Friday? Or Friday, possibly Thursday? 
Thank you, Sam. You're welcome, my dude. I got you. Enjoy all them goodies. Until the next blimp. Stay safe, man. Good work. Still got a ton of shit. Take a bit more weight off. Yeah, I hope they didn't get up too. I mean, it looks, it looks like it's gonna be a ton of freaking fun. Welcome, welcome. It's gotta be better than the last twelve movies. <laughs> I hate to be a hard ass, but I've gotta ask. Everything you're transporting above board, nothing dangerous or illicit. I'm sure they checked you on the way in, but I'm gonna have to take a second look. Do your thing, man. Shit, man. I'm just the guy that carries the shit. Cargo looks great too. I don't open the cargo because it has a whole bunch of Could void tape on it. Wow. Give me some stars. Ceramics can be used. Cool. Sweet. Two and a half. That's right, Squish. Sorry for the hassle. Can't be too careful these days. Oh, we heard you were carrying a cupid. Right? Well, hopefully you'll still come out and hang with us, Majors, while we play some Star Wars. <laughs> I mean, Battlefront 2 was pretty good once, you know, EA pulled their heads out of their ass and fixed it. Still watch. Okay, good. New strands. Sweet. We got Port Knot Shitty. Or Lake Knot City. Smoke emitting decoy cargo. Okay. Connected to the network. So we're finally on the network. Long time coming. We won't hold anything back. Capital Knot City will get everything. If all this info sharing makes everyone safer, I'm all for it. You can bet I'm not the only one here feels that way. I suppose it was better when Bridges 1 first came this way. At least I don't remember terrorists and BTs making our lives difficult back then. Well, be careful out there. The world's not what it used to be. And thank you. Finally made it past Ground Zero, Sam. Congratulations. And thank you. It'll only get harder from here, though. Thanks for the vote of confidence. When we first came through, it was different. Peaceful. The three cities out there, Lake, Middle, and South Knot, were all on board with our plans for reconstruction. Fragile Express was contracted by all three and kept supplies moving and people connected. But that all changed a year ago, when the Separatists carried out their attacks. One took out Middle Knot City. They detonated nukes from the old days. Half of South Park City went up in the other. The casualties were devastating. Bridges doesn't have the resources to link up the remaining cities on its own. We need to secure the support of everyone, even those who want nothing to do with the UCA. Impossible as that may seem. Like, what's the m motivations of blowing up cities? The situation has changed in a scenario dramatically like this. since Bridges 1 first went west. The destruction of Middle Nod in particular forced us to adapt a new strategy. It's like Amelie said, we don't have the time or resources to construct another knot on that scale. That's why we've taken to cutting deals with preppers and the like. Our only recourse is to utilize their shelters to bolster the strength of the network. It takes a special kind of person to live out here on their own. The kind that'll tell us to fuck off if we ask him to join the UCA. Oh, we know. No one's expecting them to say yes up front. But even if they don't like dealing with most people, they got on okay with Fragile Express. Don't tell me. You want us to use her credentials to get in good with them. Bingo. She's agreed to it, too. I'm gonna just see this dude without his mask at some point. And in exchange, she gets... Nothing, really. A chance to get back at Higgs, I suppose? Can't blame her for warning one. He took everything from her and then some. Time heals some wounds, but 
not hers. The work ahead won't be simple or easy, but it needs doing. Get some rest for now. We'll talk more later. Your work is great. Guessing we don't want to wet cow. Meow. Sam has got to be one worn out dude from all these workouts. Because that is a lot of leg exercise. with the pastime yeah. beaches. For me? It's called a keeper. It means not in old words. You can also use it to count stuff. I had a knot when I make a friend. Okay. Then how about I add another knot every time I see you? This must be very important to you if you were able to bring it here. Very special. It is special. I made it for you. I'll treasure it, Sam. Would you like a bug? People like to offer Sam bugs. It's, it's odd. Who the hell's in my room? Something to eat? Oh, bitch, offer me a bug. I knew it. Why are you here? Why can't you just say hello? Ask your boss man. Like, sup, Sam? Want to take a peek at this booty? I mean, why are you here? Got a delivery for a porter. You're going to need this on the road ahead. This will ID you as an associate of Fragile Express. It's woven from my blood and chiral crystals. Think of it as a kind of bond. Peppers around these parts won't give you trouble so long as you've got it. We were the only people making deliveries out here. This was our territory. Until Higgs fucked it all up. Me? The Express? Our reputation? Why are you staring at me, Squish? All of it. And now you want to fuck them back? On your own? I'm not on my own. I've got an umbrella. The cave. Kind of. Port not seedy. Next to your bed. So far apart, yet somehow we keep meeting. All that BT country in between where I should have been caught in a void out. Yet here I am. Here I am. You can use the beach? I have a beach. You've got yours. I've got mine. I use it to jump across space. I can't conjure up BTs the way Higgs can. But I can go after him. Chase him to the beach. Problem is, everyone's got their own way in. I'm only allowed to pass through the beach I know and understand. I'm sure you've heard the term multiverse. You alright? The jumps take a lot out of me. Suck my blood dry. You're going to Edge Not City, right? Place is full of terrorists. But if you're dead set on it, then you're gonna have to deal with heat sooner or later. Look, I make deliveries, killing monsters and terrorists. It's not what I do. What if we did it together? I like that plan. I could use my power to help you. You should totally do it together. We don't have to want the same thing to be on the same side. Freaky teleportation sex. I could send you across my beach. To any place the Kyrelians thick enough. Any place connected to the Chiral network. And what do you expect in return? I expect you to think it over. She expects tickets to Pound Town. Here. 
call it an incentive. And call me if you need me. This will keep us connected. See you when I see you. And she gone. Maybe. We're just collecting all kinds of bracelets. It's like the 90s. Now we're seed. I think we can use a shower. We've been through a lot, Squish. Maybe we can get some X grenades out of this. Squish, squish, squish. Squish, squish, squish. Boop. Wait, how am I going to hit skip and it goes to the shower scene? Like, what the hell? Skip. No grenades? Huh, no grenades. Oh well. Let's get out of here. Let's let's get to get to getting. Let's see what's going on in Baby's memories. City delivery terminal. Thank you for those very precise instructions Sam, that I would have done anyway. Your present objective is to extend the Cairo network from Lake Knot City to South Knot City. To that end, you'll need to utilize prepper shelters as way stations. Frankly, it won't be easy. Fragile's tried to get some of them on board, but you know how preppers are. More than a few won't want anything to do with the UCA. So we've got to prove to them they're better off with us. Figure out what they need and what we can provide, and then deliver. Do that, and they just might agree to join us. All right, get to it. The list of orders is on the terminal. What exactly would you say you do here in, in a tech? Because I don't think you kind of do shit. Share memory chip data. It's the first time I found a memory chip. Following data cannot be viewed via your cufflinks. Dawn, silent poets. Thank okay. You for your contribution. So what are we delivering? Delivering uh, an Evo Devo unit to an engineer. Elderly prescriptions and gun parts. Fragile this cargo. This is a somewhat unusual. You're gonna want. No, screw your review summary. I get it. Fragile. Don't break it. And less than 50% damage. Okay. Let those proceed. Smoke emitting decoy. God, they look freaking calling me. Do I need anything? Let's take a PCC with us. We apparently have a container repair spray. Boots? Do I have any? Yeah, I know I have spare boots. And we should have some grenades left over. Okay, let's do this. Fabricate and Ricky Vizol. Optimize our cargo. And let's go, yes, let's go. Ooh, I have a squishy frisk, baby. And a Pepsi. Ooh. Order assigned. Oh, we're back on foot. And we're going so slow. Begin and scan. Have a pleasant journey. Oh, so slow. 
Our boots are in good condition. We slept, so we got full stamina. Yes, thank you. Let's hit some people with some likes. You're passing through mule territory. Move fast and quiet. Because if they see you, it's kind of bright. If they catch you, to think that their parents were porters like you who If they catch me, I will beat the shit up out of them. That's all I that's how this goes. And now their broken children carry on the work without any understanding of what it once meant. It's a ritual to them. The delivery. An insatiable addiction. And they'll be coming for you to get their next fix. So basically, a bunch of Amazon, out of work Amazon delivery guys are after me. That's, that's my biggest threat in this game, besides BTs. A little on the heavy side. All right, where to first? Engineer, 715. Ooh, that's a long ways away. Ooh, okay, so. Can I... Jump to marker. Oh, I see. I can just push right or left and I'll jump to markers. Okay. Hmm. Engineer is up first. That's Craftsman. It's kind of like a straight shot. Can't be worried about them straight shots, man, because weapons are straight straight. I said I passed through mule territory, so I know if I shoot straight across, Keep on up. probably gonna have to deal with some chumps. What do we got? What the? Oh, it's one of those things from Horizon Zero Dawn. It's like a hologram. Well, that's unexpected and pretty cool at the same time. Huh. Looks like a way through. Do I have any materials I can take off my back to? A highway used to, to run me. through the, the first. We build roads. Oh, I got some ceramics I can donate. Add materials. Well, all these structures that players build, you can put like holograms next to them. I'm not sure what they do necessarily, but I can, I can probably change them. All right, take a little weight off of our back. That's nice. Just so you know, Sam, distro centers and the like are stocked with materials you can use to fabricate equipment. You can also take what you need to build structures. That said, there are limits to what each facility can spare. Check their terminals to see what they are. Pretty barren landscape. Oh, there's a... There's one of those freaking the dudes, the mules. Okay, if I'm gonna get around these guys, it's gonna. Looks like it's gonna take a lot of effort to get around them. I, I might be better off just trying to go through them. See, that they have these these posts that'll like ping your gear, like this. See, and that alerts them to my presence. And I think they can actually see me from a pretty good distance away. Yeah, see, like, that dude over there spotted me. And this guy. I'm just kick, kick the ass, sea bass. Get out of here. They're strand. You want some of this? You just saw what I did to your buddy, right? Like, I this shit up. You next, son. You asked for this. Same with me, not the other way around. Come on. Yeah. You know what's up. I just Superman punched his ass. Uh. What you think you got? Come here. Shit up. Counterattack! 
Oh! Kind of getting me from all over the place. How many of you assholes are there? Come with this fool. Oh yeah, I know you're there. I'm coming for you. No, no, no. I'm going to get out of this. Okay, maybe you are because you're downhill. Come on up. Come on up, Bubba. Let me get some Bubba Jean. I don't think he's getting up here. I think he's trying. Uh, let's move on. Oh, there's their camp over there. Yeah, let's just leave them be. Ooh, the sensors are structure right there. I'm actually gonna go. Let me go back and get these metals. And donate them to that structure. Might actually be pretty helpful. Yeah, ping my gear. Y'all saw what happened last time, didn't you? Oh shit, they're bringing. Slide! Cargo stolen! Wait, how did I lose cargo? No, they're definitely not in the fighting profession. Are you not, schmucka? Oh, they made me drop my grenades. When the hell did that happen? Oh well. What ifs? Oh, that was heavy. That was heavy. We're gonna drop these metals off at that bridge we saw. Oh shit, here comes another dude. Dudes. Great. Oh, that was not really looking to fight more people. Especially after encumbering myself. Got two dudes. Got one dude. Got Cletus. You shit up, son. Uh. Bet y'all didn't know I was a fucking ninja. Pathfinder. I wonder if by Pathfinder they mean kick shit out of camp guy. I whooped the their asses. I wonder if there's anybody left at their camp. Is this like seven dudes laying down, <laughs> laying down over there? We could go check out the camp. I mean, I don't see any movement, but that doesn't mean much. I am here to donate. Search the camp. Okay. Ooh, let's drop this stuff off. Some weight off our friggin' back. Sweet! These here London bridges. It's kind of along the way, so not as well. There's a bunch of metals here. I don't know how long people stay knocked out. Ooh. Over here. Oh god. God damn it. Fright? My thoughts exactly. We're gonna see what they got in their pod. What are you doing? Unlock that post box, baby. What's in here? Boots, 
tons of metals. That's pretty much it. Let's take 200 metals. 100 metals. That's honestly all we got the room for. There's a pack of 400 metal there, but I can't carry that shit. I'm already freaking overweight as, as is. Okay, where is this engineer's place exactly? He is not too far away. Let us proceed. I don't know what the range is on their little beacon thingies. Uh, I could offload the metal. I really don't have anything else to do with the metal, so I'm just going to offload it in this structure. Run for it. It's so pretty out here. I can't get over how good this game looks. It did work out because I knocked out the entire camp already. <laughs> see, methyls. Man, this thing. This whole thing takes freaking 1760 pieces of metal. And ceramics, which I have none of. Okay, well that's a bunch of weight off my back, so let's go. Engineer, alright. Not really worried about their little post pinging me because I knocked all their asses out. City. I'm not headed that way or else I'd pick that stuff up. 400 metals just laying on the ground over there. That's 40 pounds worth though. Fifty metals. Ah, someone was nice enough to put a, a ladder down for me. Whoa, wait, 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 what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Jesus titty. Ignore me. Fucking done. <laughs> you can call out and people can answer. Here, I, I will like your ladder. It's a good day. I'll give you all the likes. Yeah. yeah, you just push the big button and you'll call out, and sometimes you'll get an answer. Name's Sam. Why can't any of this cargo laying around before where I'm going? Beginning scan. Scanning bridges ID. Oh man, I am tired. I need something to drink. Agile Express ID verified. Weapons detected. All weapons will be locked until departure. Cargo Thank you. Thank you. I don't have any weapons. I have some string, that's all I got. That's 15 pounds off my back. Delivering cargo. Thanks. Sam Bridges, I presume? I've heard of you. The man trekking across the country trying to reconnect folks. I appreciate you bringing me this. I do. How does he know that, though? He's in his bunker by himself. Now let me just check the cargo. Huh. And he's wow. not on the chiral network. You took really good care of this. I'll let Bridges know how the VNV testing goes. Thanks again. VNV testing? Is that like how lesbians test things? No, that's V2V testing. <laughs> That's scissor testing. You heard it here first. Scissor testing. 
Two and a quarter stars. Ooh. I'm now an expert handler. Grade 20. Now receive more likes. Good for me. I like it, the likeies. I need you to understand something. It's about Fragile. You might have heard she helped terrorists. That she didn't care who got hurt. But I'm telling you, that's gotta be bullshit. Her and her people put their lives on the line to get us what we needed. She's a hero through and through. Look, I was born in this shelter. The only world I've ever known is within these walls. So when people talk about America, I can't even begin to imagine it. But if that Cupid connects me to everyone else, I won't have to. America was pretty so, great. Yeah. People sitting around playing see, video games for other people. I want to see what I've been missing. <laughs> It was the golden age. <clears throat> you put him on the net. Switch. Sweet. Another bridge is restored. The engineers provided design for a power skeleton. Oh, shit. That looks a lot like what um, Huey wore in Metal Gear Solid 5. In fact, it might legit be the same thing. Does that do what I think it does? Does that increase my carry weight? Because that would be incredible. Standalone 3D printer is capable of chiral printing. Assuming it works, the Evo Devo unit should enable me to replicate all kinds of archived objects. We can rebuild America one piece at a time. In the meantime, I can use the network to see what's going on in the cities. Track mule and terrorist activity. It's like you brought me the whole wide world in that package. Would you say I brought you Thank the world wide web? Let's do business again. Oh yeah. I've got a little something I'd like you to put through its paces. An assist unit I developed myself. Works perfectly in sim trials, but I need someone to test it out on solid ground. I would be more and than happy to. if it makes your too. job a little easier, all the better. I like how my cargo has, like, void of broken tape on it. <gasps> he just gave me one? Sam, active skeletons attach to your legs and augment your physical capabilities. The one you've got there is a load-bearing AS, designed to reinforce your joints. Just Fragile's wearing got a an AS will provide AS. Go ahead and make <laughs> it. But Remove cargo and equip. Including a power skeleton causes any cargo attached to your hips to be offline. Oh, okay, that's no biggie. I can just pick it up again. Yeah, it's it's seriously like the exo legs that Huey wore in Metal Gear Solid Five. That's freaking cool as hell. Thank you kindly. Come around again soon. Uh, no, dude. Thank you. Good work. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further information. Oh my god, I can carry... Add like a hundred freaking kilograms to what I can carry. That's ridiculous. Okay, I'm... Sorry, dude. I'm not going to... Like, not city. Not right meow. It's a badass gift, man. It's almost as good as having the freaking bike. All right, that's one prepper way station. Two to go. It's better than the hat for sure. And I delivered a hell of a lot more for that guy, and all that asshole gave me was a hat. Ooh, someone was nice enough to build a generator. I will be more than happy to donate some crystals for your cause. I have no metal though. All right, where to? Boop, 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 boop. Scanning. Oh yeah, let's go deliver this guy's medicine. Oh man, these legs help you run faster too. Oh, they help you jump a good ways too. Oh my God, these things are fucking amazing. Yeah, way better than a hat. Oh my god, I just cleared the whole stream. Hell yes. 
Oh my god, these are so good. They're good as long as you know there's a generators and stuff. Yeah, the bike's the bike's pretty damn helpful too. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, the bike would still be preferred over going on foot. Gallium crystals, dilithium crystals, Punjabi crystals. Okay, I don't see this guy's place on the side of the hill. He must be up over the place. trying to calculate what would be better if we try to scale the mountain or try this route over here god this game's good looking doesn't look like the creek runs up the side of the hill oh yeah the floaty bugs. You can get floaty bugs from like, see like, they, they float. Destroyed cargo. Oh, wait, is this a cave? I get my crystals. So easy to collect. There's kind of no reason not to collect them. Ooh! Another data disc. There we go. A ladder. You know what? We're about to do some climbing. We might as well pick up a ladder. Oh, I wonder if... You know what? Let's... Let's create a sign. Do we have a sign for memory chips? Ah, we do, in fact. Memory chip. Anybody hear me? See? Somebody answered me. I hear you. William Lake provided this ladder. Hey! 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 Still seems a bit steep. Manageable. We could still very well be taking the hard way up. He's scaling the shit and he ain't even using his hands, man. It's hardcore. That is just ridiculously freaking pretty. <sighs> I really wish this game had a photo mode. I think photo mode should be like an industry standard now, especially for absolutely beautiful games like this. I know I could take a picture, but I don't want to take it with a PlayStation. It's got the HUD and everything. Oh my god, it's 5.30. Fragile. Something tells me this guy doesn't really give a shit who delivers his life-saving medication. Who am I kidding? It's probably phone or pills. Hey, it's a washing machine. An old freaking toaster. <laughs> That's some old world, that's some old school shit right there, y'all. Here, have your medicine, your prescription meds. Delivering cargo. I've been expecting you. You are my lifeline. 
I've only managed to get this far thanks to Porters, and you don't ask for anything in return. You have my gratitude. I mean, it doesn't mean you can't give Let's me something. Let's see how's the package. Wow, this is great. That's what she said about Excellent my package. Excellent job, thank you. They're life giving. <laughs> Awesome. Oh, bridge links. Lots of bridge links. I brought this guy's boner pills and got... Forty-five bridge link points? That does not seem right. I wonder if that was a bug. Holy crap, Ola. Yeah, this doesn't really seem quite right. You have reached cargo condition grade 10. Be able to keep your balance more easily. Oh, sweet. Just say thank you, right? Like my star filled out a little bit here. So you're here on behalf of Fragile Express. Please tell me you put the terrorists behind you. When Fragile, the daughter of the founder, started associating with other couriers, things started getting scary around here. Rumors say that she caused the explosion at Middle Knot City, and there's a part of me that believes it. Did she? Of course, then? she could be just another one of their victims. Are you connecting the Cairo network? I don't mind the contract with Bridges, but I'm not going to join the UCA. Don't be Go a ahead, dick, dude. You're fine with that. I wonder if I, I wonder if you do enough deliveries if he'll join anyways. Maybe you already heard it from Fragile. But preppers who don't want to be a part of the UCA can still sign a contract with Bridges to join the network. They get to use our delivery services and other basic Cairo network infrastructure, much like our full members. Similarly, he you'll be able to use member. their Cairo printing facilities to replenish your supplies. They are not, however, obligated to exchange data with us. So don't expect them to share intel or help with the development of new tech. In an ideal world, everyone would be a part of the UCA, of course. But failing that, we want everyone to at least be a part of the network. Get your they can always change their me. minds after the fact. The Cupid will interface differently with the terminal depending on the type of contract. So connect your Cupid to confirm. Thank you, Skullface. <clears throat> Who was the villain in Metal Gear Solid 5? Seriously, this game shares a lot with Metal Gear. Maybe they do. I don't know. There is the star system of how much each place likes you. So, I mean, if I get four or five stars, maybe it'll, maybe I'll change his mind and join the UCA. We don't know. It doesn't know. The company just got too big. In times like these, we should all keep it close and tight. That goes for couriers, too. That Otherwise, we we'll just too. make the same mistakes. No majors, that sucks so bad. Coalitions, states, connecting all kinds of people together. It's just asking for trouble. Sorry. It's been a while since I last talked to anyone. Travel safe. See you around, then. If that's the case, he's probably pretty disappointed that I wasn't fragile. <laughs> Good morning. New order I'd look forward to fragile Please showing up at my door. Good job, Sam. That's two prepper way stations integrated into the Cairo network. Just one more left. Where is it? You. If there's Some one, you upgrade. Okay, that's nice. Please stop calling me. Stop calling me. Ooh, wait, what is going on here?
Elder. Oh, no, no, okay, I see what's going on here. So I just need to go to the craftsman. Craftsman. Oh, there's a generator. Let's charge up before we freaking go. Hi, Squish. Charge up our exo legs. What direction are we headed? Craftsman? Craftsman. I wonder if we can go far enough out there to climb the snowy mountain. We probably can. That'd be pretty cool. Let's just jump off the side of the mountain and get myself freaking killed. 200 medals? Who could refuse? Especially with my super legs. Okay, let's, let's let's not sprint. Easy, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Careful, careful, and we're good. Oh, we got pinged. We gotta bounce. We gotta make like an auto bot and roll out. And we're gonna get spotted here soon too. Oh, I got three people running up on my right. Go, exo legs, go! Carry me to safety, exo legs. I feel like I should have a pretty easy time outrunning them if I have, you know, exoskeletal legs. Damn! So I'm halfway across the freaking river. Let's see them do that. Can you? Can you do that? Let's see what you got. Show me what you've got. place for me to donate some metal. <laughs> They're still crossing the river. <laughs> Norman Reedus with the long jump, baby. They still coming after me? Oh no, they got a car! What? Alright, alright, um... Give up. I think they gave up. Yeah, I can use the structure, so they gave up. Rebuild these roads. Have some kind. Oh, that took a lot of crystals. But I am. Not out. I like how it plays the little jingle from London Bridges because we're making a bridge. London squishies, yowling down, yowling down, yowling down. Oh, I could use a generator. My little robotic legs are feeling kind of wobbly. Oh man, these little robotic legs are the greatest gift we've gotten in this game so far. I have something for you. Gun parts and anti-BT weapons. Made of my blood, no doubt. Delivering cargo. Using their IDs to complete the delivery. So, well, good work.
look, son. You should be happy you got I'll your take shit. That off your hands. Package looks. Man, everybody's talking about my package. Brand new. Wow. Been a while since I've seen cargo in such good shape. Thank you kindly. I no, it couldn't have been easy. What are you talking about, Majors? Another S for awesome. Cargo condition. Why do I keep getting so many bridge link points? Like, expert mover. Especially last time, I got like an insane amount of points. Everyone was behind the attack that wiped out Middlemont City. Only a damn fool trusts that terrorist to deliver shit now. But here you are. I don't remember what sounds I made. Keep her business alive for her, am I right? I swear. Can't trust anyone these days. And don't try sweet talking me onto your little network. You know why there's been so many terrorist attacks recently? Because you douches with attitudes like with you. Your talk of reuniting the country. Join the ECA. I may as well paint a bullseye on my shelter. Just keep my deliveries coming. We'll get along just fine. I don't need any trouble. Don't need Though any I will trouble. say, I appreciate these hematic grenades of yours. Quality work. Gotta admit, not the sort of equipment the UCA ought to keep to itself. There's a lot of freelance porters operating in these parts, after all. If I could churn these out by the boatload and gear up those folks, now you're good people. I can see that. And you brought my order like I asked. But it'll take more than that for me to agree to what you're asking. Chiral Network is a big step. But if you could prove to me Bridges is an organization I can trust. Hmm. What about this? Do another run for me. I'll put the details on the terminal there. Of course you want something. New order available. Please access <sighs> these people. They just take, 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 take. Recover tools from a crater. Cargo collection from a BT area. Oh dear. He's sending me on a Mission Impossible, man. What a dick. The toolkit you're looking for ought to be in my old shelter. It's been tagged, so you shouldn't have any trouble finding the place. I'll unlock it remotely once you get there. Oh, and take some of those hematic grenades you brought with you. Nothing you'll want more when those BTs put your back against the wall, right? Here's hoping it won't come to that. I want to see the other side, according to this game. Porter boots. I will take both of these. <laughs> it's boogie. It's bob. It's bob. Bang, bang, diggy, diggy, diggy. Set up, boogie. Set up, drop the boogie. Any generators within viewing distance? Wait, who the hell are these guys? What's up? What's up? Porters are freelance delivery personnel. They don't steal your cargo and don't pose any threat. Oh, so they just, um... They're just giving me stuff. Sure, I'll take that. Give you some likes, Mr. Porter. Boom! You get a big old thanks. Bam! Look at that. Thanks Ooh, get them likes. He thumbs. He this thumbs up. You. Hmm. I don't want your climbing anchor. Get the hell on. All right, we're crazy tired. Why are you so tired, my dude? Weapons restrictions lifted. Have a drink. Looks like you could use it. Crater. Oh god, we gotta go to a freaking crater. Well, let's at least stay in the power grid. Scanning bridges ID. Fragile express ID verified. Weapons detected. Let's cover as much ground as we can while we're on the grid. While you're on the grid, your stuff doesn't use battery power, so as well get as far as you can with it. 
Uh, of course it's gonna rain. Like this a floaty bug. Man, these legs are just the freaking greatest. They make these journeys just go by so much faster. But this is BT territory. Mm, let's pick up ceramics on the way back if we see him again. You know, I think I brought. I did. Bridge, watchtower. Okay, I can't put a generator right here. Oh, no network coverage. Okay. Okay. Um, well, in that case, stick to the grenades. <clears throat> I like to change color. Yeah, because the battery's running out. And we got BTs. It should last as long as we don't sprint around. I figure we might be okay. Get a flashlight. I figure my little shoulder buddy would double as a flashlight. Get your BTS out here. Ah. That's so cool. Sleeping tablets for the elder. Seems like any pills I find go to the elder guy. That is not why I am here. There are a lot of BTs here. But you know, if they don't leave me much choice, I make it break right off. Is there anything else around here? Ceramics. Don't see much else. BT land, man. Just hold her breath and do a little sneaky sneak. This little thing is just so cool, man. Do anything? Private locker. Holy crap. There is a lot of shit here. Let's take a few ceramics with us just for shits and grins. A little metal. We'll leave the uh, heavier stuff there. 
There's a lot of supplies in that locker. Shame it's in the middle of freaking BT territory. Hold it down. And how do we get out of here in one piece? I don't want to go through the building like I did last time. Uh, maybe we can get up and over the wall? Oh. Don't know if this route's going to be any more beneficial for me. Giggity, they're freaking everywhere. We're almost through. I'm like outside the wall. Hopefully there's no stray BTs on this side. That would suck. I think we're clear. I think we're ever clear. That wasn't that wasn't too bad. Pretty easy run. Let's use our robo legs and get the hell on. Yeah, this game, the atmosphere in this game is freaking tremendous. Like, I love everything about this game. I don't know what the, the other people were complaining about. But I'm freaking loving this. Okay, I shouldn't run because running is kind of draining my battery way too fast. Yeah, it, it see, like, the attention to detail is one of the things I really love about this game, too. Like, our legs started off what, like blue or green to indicate it had a full charge. And then it turns yellow, and now it's red. Just to show you that, you know, the battery's low without having to look at the gauge. Beginning scan. Alright, we're on the grid. Fragile Express ID verified. Weapons detected. All weapons will be locked until departure. Cargo I don't know what weapons they're talking about. I really don't have any weapons. I have like string. Our backpack is piled up really high. Here, take your freaking tools. <laughs> you actually went into that hello. Yeah, you sent me douche. <sighs> you, you don't know what this means to me. Whole lot of memories in these old tools. The kind of stuff you can't replace with a chiral printer. I was giving you an impossible mission. We'll do better next uh, time, dickbag. Yes, now we're talking. Whether you see the weapons I make with these. Wait till they get a load of me. You are incredible. Thank you. I am incredible. I am pretty damn incredible. So what weapons are you going to make with your tools? Wow, that gave me like a whole star and a half. Elite mover. Hell yeah. Jeez, bridge link grade 60. Which is like all the multiplayer stuff that I never use. <laughs> Fragile and her crew never did me wrong. Could say I owe them even. 
that they're running with Higgs now. And that makes them as bad as him, don't it? It's as if all the motherfucking terrorists are coming together like one big happy family. <laughs> Might be time for us to do the same. Maybe there's hope for us after all. <laughs> At least if there's more folks like you in the UCA. Safety in numbers, huh? And the new America to boot. Connect me to the chiral network. Sweet. Maybe he'll give us a recipe for something. I like that our baby's just like, what the fuck is going on? Here I was, just kicking it in my fluid, and then I started floating on top of floating. A bola gun. Oh shit. Our first weapon weapon. Right. Now that you're looking out for me, it's only fair that I look out for you. I like so, the way you think, keep guy. Me connected. Keep on supplying you with my best tools. Please do. And together we all might live a little longer. Oh, by the way, check out this beauty I made. It's called a bola gun. Should keep anyone from giving you trouble for a minute. It's non-lethal, of course. I can't promise it won't leave marks, but that's on there. If you think you could use <laughs> it, take it. Yes, um, yes, and yes. There's the three reasons. A bola right gun, huh? That could come in handy. You freaking As think? is, you can use it to restrain human targets without killing them. When do I get stuff that but can kill them? But swap out those wires with strands spun from your blood, and it might even work on BTs. Go ahead. Give it a whirl. I will, thank you. Put that bad boy right there on my tool rack. Well, you've done your bit. Time for me to do mine. You just gave me a bullet gun? That's that's more than most have done for me. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further information. Ah, new order. What do you need? Where am I even headed? To the engineer, to the elder. Let's take your supplies to Lake Sit not City, because I have a feeling that's where I'm going. Uh, I need to find a freaking generator for my power legs before they go janky on me. And I'm doing the janky leg. Because these power legs are incredible! Order assigned. I'm still underweight even if my legs give out. Oh, it's back in the yellow, so they've been charging. Excellent work, Sam. You've brought three way stations into the fold. The preppers are on the grid and the chiral network is looking better than ever. We're planning to use a regional distro center as our next way station. But that'll have to wait. Got a priority task here. A mess in need of cleaning up. We need you to recover one of Lake Knot City's system servers. How do you they sent secure it out messages and mules sent to the chiral on the network way back. Under. The server contains validation data for a new delivery system we're deploying. Once in place, it will use the Cairo network to automate deliveries. To us, it's invaluable. To the mules, it may as well be a toaster. A toaster they'll happily tear apart for the Cairo crystals and rare earth metals inside. If we don't act quickly, we could lose that data. We're not losing that so data. So get your ass to the mules drop site, snatch the server, and bring it back to Lake Knot City. I'm putting the order in myself. Check your cufflinks for details. You got it, my dude. But, but, not today, my friends. For right now, we've got to save. We've got to save. Because I've got to go. Because it's six o'clock. And way past the stream. So we'll be back on tomorrow, usual time. Un to four. Un to four Eastern Squishy time. And I'll try to find out from GameStop if they're having a 9 o'clock release for Star Wars. And if they are, we'll do a late stream Thursday. And of course, you know, we'll be playing the Star Wars. 
And I kind of think that's it for the year, except for Art Genesis. So we're going to play Death Stranding and Star Wars until we finish them. And jump into Arc Genesis when it comes out. So that's the that's the game plan for the rest of the year. And, you know, through the holidays and everything. So thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. I hope you guys are enjoying Death Stranding as much as me and Squish are. And Zoltar. Zoltar too. I think Zoltar is enjoying. Yep, see? Zoltar is like, yes, Death Stranding. Stretch for it. It's true. Play Red Dead. And after that, I'm done with the pro. <laughs> I don't know. We might... I'll think about playing Red Dead. I will consider it. I'll consider it. That'll, that'll take a lot of streams and a lot of hours, so we'll, we'll see. But again, thank you guys for watching, and we will see you guys tomorrow. Have a great night, and be safe out there. Squish, anything to add? Actually, Squish got Squish Tongue. Squish Tongue. You can show him? Show him Squish Tongue. Like, there it is. It's not much Squish Tongue, but it's Squish Tongue. What a great way to end the stream with squish tongue. Squish tongue. Squish. 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 Squish.